Okay, hello everyone. Small talk about the Baby 8 sequencer. Because it's a very handy tool. And why it's a handy tool? Because it's a sequencer for control voltage. But it's also uh, a trigger output sequencer for drums. Um, we kind of first listen to the CV and you can control every step by the pot meters. That makes it really nice. And there's a scale. You can make the shorter uh, sequencer, like two or three or four with a reset uh, and then put it in a trigger. I will show you later. Let's listen to it. Now we go to some steps. There is a, it's in a wavetable sound. All the steps are tweakable. Then you create a song. And of course, if you put your LFO in there in the clock, it will go automatically. If we change it the scale, it will change uh, the whole amount, like low or high. Now it's a sequencer with eight steps. If I want to make it like four steps or two steps or six steps, I just put one in the reset and one over here. Now you will see that it's smaller. You can make this uh, longer if you want to. shorter only two steps really nice okay that's one thing what you can do with it but you can use it of course also for drums we have up here the simple drum of uh, sound machines, great stuff from Italia. And uh, yeah, we're gonna listen to it. Simple drum has six triggers. So uh, what we can do, we take the trigger from the sequencer of the Baby 8. I put the oscillator a little bit down. Then we can listen to some drums. Okay, let's say I take a trigger here and a trigger here. Now, if the light is there, you you will hear the the drum. Nice. We have more cables because we have six triggers. You see if the light is there that you hear the sound. That's how you can make a whole tune. There is a reset button here. 
and a step button. The reset button, if I take the clock out of there, the reset button will go over there. So if this is a trigger, Now you can make some sounds. If you want to have the rhythm more fast, you just put the LFO faster in the sequencer. So that's one part that you can make a drum sequencer of this really nice uh, feature there is are more small parts and things that you can do with this you can make it also as, as a kind of wave shaper uh, if we have a wave let's say this really fast now it can't even go faster uh, if you put oscillator in there let's say this wave I put a little bit harder If you put it in an LFO, like from Dupfer, it will even go faster. Or in a, let's say, a Fisio. Uh, yes. Okay, thanks for watching. This is the Baby 8. Uh, why uh, I like them so much is because of the yeah, because of the simplicity of it. It's really a simple tool. It's not expensive. It's under the hundred euro. Uh, assembled and well. Um, there are more. Uh, uh, sequencers there in Eurorack they're quite more expensive but also they can do less sometimes you need to have expanders for drum triggers or uh, other stuff and actually this for what your money and for what you get it, it's great I use it a lot that's why it's in my uh, standard setup it's made by Danny it's from Rotterdam from Das Ding or Tat it's great stuff thank you for watching bye 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 bye